I don't care what anyone says, peak week does not start until that first bite of rice. It's Thursday, I start my carb up today, so I'll be carving up Thursday, Friday, I'll deplete Saturday, and then the show's on Sunday. And this week has been, I've felt all the feels, I've been extremely tired, I've felt everything, but it's just almost show day. Now that I'm, a, I'm about to eat my rice, haven't had any carbs yet, and then then we'll be ready. Then we might start getting excited. I'm not excited and I'm not, well, I'm excited obviously, but I'm not like nervous or anything yet. Maybe, maybe once this rice is consumed. When going into peak week, it's really important to keep all your food the same and keep all variables as similar as possible because we know what our body responds to. We don't want any inflammation. We don't want any bloating. We got to keep things as consistent. So I'm not going to take you through anything of what I'm eating because I've showed you guys all my full days of eating on my high days and my depletion. So it's the exact same. Today, carving up 150 grams of rice now, four eggs, and I'm going to do some posing later. But now it's time to actually chill out. I did my last cardio session last night. I will still train the next two days, just no cardio and less steps. So my legs are still feeling a little bit inflamed, a bit heavy. I'll probably go do some recovery boots and go get a massage just to help my body de-stress. But that's about it. And I'll update you. I'm getting my tan done tomorrow and I'm just going to take you through the next few days until show day. Just got my lashes redone. I got a lash artistry by Bianca. She's easily the best. When I lost my license, I was going to someone else and they were still good, but I literally recommend her to absolutely everyone. Like I'm willing to drive to go get her to do my lashes and I wouldn't trust anyone else. Work all day today. I've got check-ins. Um, my clients know that I'll be a little bit slow with replying to them, but I have. I worked a lot extra this week to try and get everything done. But I'm going for my tan in a few hours, so I can't wait. Next time I see you, I'll probably be a lot darker shade. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. I got my base coat done, so we are looking. Pretty tanned. This is the first time I have fake tanned since my ICN show last year. So it's been over a year. So I got two layers now. I have athlete check-in in the morning. So today's Friday, athlete check-in in the morning. My brain's not working. And another two coats and then I'll get another coat on the day. So we'll definitely get a lot darker than this. But I also saw Scott before I got my tan done. He was so happy with how I was looking because it was kind of like the worst circumstance. It was like, Usually this is the day that I look at my worst after like two high carb days. I had five liters of water. I haven't gone to the toilet. Uh, but like she's still snatched. Like can't go to the toilet, but you can't tell and fake it to make it. So that's all that matters. Anyways, I'll see you tomorrow. Rise and shine. One day out, I can confirm I had the worst sleep of my life. In fact, I don't even think I slept, so I had the worst six hours of my life. Let me gather myself, have a coffee. I'm getting my head on this morning before check in. Hopefully I can wake up a bit of a normal functioning human. One day out. Guys, this is uh, this is a win. I didn't get any tan on my bed sheets. Call me a professional. That is a win and a half because I was not willing to put new different sheets on there or wash wash any sheets to be honest. Thank you. This is for my YouTube video, so we can all smile. I knew you were gonna do it. I would. I'd actually eat it right now. Okay. 
All right, Tavi, tell us what's in the bag. We got some the... retails. Okay, these actually look solid though. Eat it, I dare you to eat it. You're one day out, do it. What flavor is yours? She, she doesn't want me to win. <laughs> <laughs> she wants me to look fat. <laughs> okay, no, these what actually look Oh, I think we got the same. Raspberry cheese. Are they gluten free? You're guilt free, indulgent, low sugar, oh, high protein bar, palm oil free. Guilt free. I bet you if I ate that, I'd feel guilty. I feel guilty already. <laughs> <laughs> we have problems. I actually am really keen to try this. Same. Do I think I have any more? Because I want another one, but I want to eat chocolate one. Uh, Where do I steal it from? Problem. I want to steal it. No, you've got to mess up my hair. It ain't even real. Oh, oh god damn. Okay, pizza? yeah. Wait. It actually suits you. My head is so small. <laughs> Wait. It looks good. <laughs> we are at the ICN show. Georgia. Ooh. Georgia is warming up for sports. I'm not going to be able to watch her bikini because the bikini is on at like 10 p.m. So it's 5 now. It's going to be a late... Late night. Late night for you. Um, but yeah, warming up now. So she's pretty much just had a few carbs. This is what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, but I'm going to show you some of her day too because it's her day and it's special and I want her a part of my vlog because she is a big part of my prep. So. <laughs> That's a low weigh-in. And it's show day. That's as low as I've been. 54. And it's time to rock and roll. I have my hair and makeup lady coming out to... So do my makeup at 6.45. Oh my god, it's shooting! Awesome. We're just making our way to the uh, Melbourne Marathon. I've actually, I'm, I've actually decided to do the marathon today. Taylor, so gonna yeah. Park. So we're going to park. Taylor's going to run the marathon first. <laughs> and then, <laughs> then, we, then we're going to pick her up yeah. and go back to the Kingston Arts Centre. Yeah, so she's going to do her fasted cardio and then... We'll, yeah. s we'll see you at the venue. Yeah. I was just gonna wait on the sidelines with her hair and makeup on. <laughs> and I'd like to thank our, our season sponsors, Bulk Nutrients, who have no. <laughs> Taylor's just having a carb up at the moment for her marathon. <laughs> we just had a bit of pre-workout as well and I found my glutes is enough <laughs> for me to <laughs> get through the 42 <laughs> kilometers. <laughs> Oi, if that was someone else, I'd be really offended if someone said that to me. But well, they, that's payback Lee, for me saying Lisa that she, she had scoliosis <laughs> in her glutes. And she was like, that's actually me rude. I'm fucking, yeah, she's saying Six I'm weeks fat. out, it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Day of show, probably <laughs> borderline bullying. <laughs> You are. Oh, that's just good. Yeah, you're good. Okay, you're not as flat as I thought you might be. Oh, yeah. yeah, nice. Pretty happy with this, Tabby. Can you, can you just hold this? <laughs> this is really good. Goldilocksy. Oh my god. Yes! Go, Tabby! Look at her! Yes! Tabby Knight, Junior Champion of Victoria, Tabby Knight. Yes! That's my best friend! Ow! I'm so sore. <laughs> 
So I thought I would come on and give a quick update because it's actually been a few days post-show and how I'm feeling. I'm the type of person I get very overwhelmed like on the actual day and as soon as I get off stage that I can't really comprehend how I'm feeling. I'm not like an emotional person. So when people are like, oh my God, like you did so well, congrats, are you happy? I'm like, yeah. Like, cause I don't know, obviously I'm happy. And like I've always said, I love the process of prep. Getting on stage for me is literally just a bonus. So I, so a few things to touch on. Could I have come in better? Yes. Could I have presented a better package? Yes. But am I happy? Oh my God, I'm so happy. And the reason I'm so happy is because comparing how I looked from ICN last year, from the last time I stepped on stage, was the biggest difference. I'm going to actually attach a photo. And at the end, or I'll do it there, whatever. <laughs> I don't know how this stuff works. And I think this sport is all about progression. I was the youngest up on stage there, so my muscle maturity just isn't there and for me it was always going to be a developmental issue so in that regard am i happy with like how i placed yes so i got first in so i'm the victorian junior bikini champion which is exciting that's kind of what i wanted um i just wanted to obviously do my best but i wanted to place well in juniors because that is like my kind of category and then in opens which i get so it's against everyone i came third which is awesome the girls who placed first and second, definitely deserved it over me. They had the size. Um, I think I did, I was very conditioned, so I don't think conditioning was an issue for me, but they definitely had the size and the development over me. Both the girls were, well, I know the one in second was like 26, so she was 20, she was six years older than me, and I'm pretty sure the girl who came first, Beck, she looked amazing, and Kyla came second, so I don't know if they watched these, but um, they both looked amazing. Beck's bikini, absolutely next level. Um, so yeah, Beck, so she had the size over me. So honestly, she had the bikini proportion. She showed up the best on the day in her stage presence. Honestly, it was awesome. So definitely deserved. I was up against those two girls in first timers as well. So it was the same outcome. I got third in first timers, third in opens, first in juniors. So, um, on the day I was very, I was extremely flat. As you know, I woke up with a low weight. So I was 54 on the dot, which I've never been all prep. Even now, um, it's been a few days post show. I'm sitting like... A kilo and a half up like oh i'm like 55 at the moment but some days it fluctuates so yeah i was really low i was really flat and i couldn't seem to carb up i wasn't really too sure backstage like how to pump up because i'm obviously a newbie to this sport i wasn't um so i didn't really know how to pump up what foods i should be having so that's just something going into nationals we need to be more on top of obviously i'm a tall person so i need to eat a lot more than someone who was a little bit shorter and because I don't have the size there, I need to come in a lot fuller. I looked a little bit stringy on stage and flat because I hadn't consumed enough carbohydrates. So could I have brought a better me? Yes. Do I think that would have affected my placing? Honestly, no. But I would have been happier um, looking at it now if I had have carved up. But in saying that, I'm so glad that that happened because I'm like, okay, well, I've still got nationals in Brisbane in three weeks and then I've still got Japan in five weeks so I make those changes and that's another thing about like going into your seasons do more than one competitions because if you do one show and it doesn't go exactly how you want it to you wanted it to or go to plan you need to improvise like make those improvements for your next shows so I'm really excited to see how I go at nationals and Japan again I have literally no expectations I don't even know the other girls uh do you have a lot more size over me i am young but that doesn't mean i'm going to not put in 100 percent. i'm going to show up my best i was really happy with how i posed on the day taylor madison if you guys need a posing coach hook her up she's the best poser um hands down all the girls looked absolutely amazing even all her girls placed top three like first second third were all um posing clients of taylor's so she's awesome uh, my posing has come such a long way since icn and so yeah, overall, I'm really happy with how I went. After, I just went to a Greek restaurant and had some food. And all I really wanted was an almond cappuccino. <laughs> so the next day, I had an almond cappuccino. But yeah, back on track. This So our plan going forward, well, it's just honestly coming full off. So I've backed off cardio a little bit, up the intensity with training, and I'm eating a little bit more at the moment. But my I am really tired post-show. Even like now, I'm still feeling a little bit fatigued. But 
yes anyways i just want to say a big thank you to obviously one ifbb pro league tony doherty for putting on an awesome show stacy from 67 bikinis for my bikini i had a lot of compliments on it and i loved it fit absolutely amazing literally backstage we had to like fix some things up with it but it's good that stacy actually comes to the shows and can do this to my sponsors uncensored you guys hands down are the best the most of you guys give me so much support i you know i use your products every single day and if you guys do want to check out the uncensored supplements i do have a discount code which is tabby 10 you guys know i use their protein twice a day every day i use their bcaas their creatine their and all their supplements so i definitely highly recommend they're a great team great supportive network so definitely go and support them um Taylor for being my stage mom. Definitely, obviously, hope it helped me with posing too. And my bikini was inspired by her. So that as well. My sister for actually flying down literally the morning of my show to come and watch me means the absolute world. Combat physio for obviously my treatment for the past 20 weeks and dealing with me every single week. So go check out the combat physio. Team every week, Rulan, you're amazing. Thank you for putting up with me. Obviously, to my family friends, I had so many clients um, coming to watch and that just means the absolute world to me to have all your support as well. Obviously, this is just show one. We've got a lot to improve on. Every competitor that turned up that day looked absolutely amazing. And I think we all were just like really overwhelmed with how the day went. Laura Young, who won the overall title as well, hands down, absolutely deserved it because... I mean, just look at her for seat. She's a boss bitch. So, <laughs> and she's an awesome vibe too. Like she's actually a genuinely really cool human. So thank you guys. This video is very short. My next vlogs, I'll make sure I try to get a little bit more, but I did want to just upload something to show the big show. Thank you.